So what are you doing to me? It's a valid question when you're Velcro wrapped from your waist to your ankles in what looks like giant blood pressure cuffs. This device is called external counter pulsation or ECP. And it's been used for the last 25, 30 years for patients who have chronic unstable angina or heart failure. What we're doing is increasing blood flow going back to your heart. And the University of Kansas Health System doctor, Patrick Moriarty, hopes that this treatment one day will be used to also treat Alzheimer's and dementia because the blood flow isn't just being pushed back to the heart. But we also want to see how well it increases blood flow to your brain. And Dr. Moriarty says his studies have shown a cognitive improvement in people who've done the therapy consistently over time. Jill Chadwick has volunteered to be our test subject, so Dr. Moriarty can show us how it works. She does not have heart disease, Alzheimer's, or dementia. She does happen to be the director of media relations and the medical news network here at the health system, and it turns out she's also a pretty good sport. Why do you agree to do this, Jill? Because I didn't ask enough questions. These three cuffs that are on each leg are synchronized to constrict up to six pounds per square inch. They'll start at one pound of pressure per square inch and titrate up to six. It does actually feel good. Well, going back to the brain, again, it's only 2% of our body mass, but it gets 20% of cardiac output. And Dr. Moriarty says after the age of 20, blood flow decreases to the brain by 5% every 10 years. Jill is trying to process the sensation of this experience. It was like left, right, left, right, and now it's like together. It feels pretty strong at one. <laughs> My legs are getting a good massage. Slowly, they begin the process of titrating up to six pounds of pressure. Oh, there goes the left one. <laughs> I'm like, what's coming next? I'm feeling it. Oh my gosh. When it's time to stop the machine and set Jill free, she says she feels fine, just a little tingly. Oh, and now everything is tingling. Everything is tingling. It's tingling. Dr. Moriarty says now that all of his research and studies are complete, all that's left is to wait and see if the FDA approves the ECP machine as a treatment for Alzheimer's disease and dementia.